Good afternoon. Tesla 6 kit. Been using it for a week. Um, it's been out and about with me. But what I'd like to do is basically go down to the table. Show you around it. Come back up. Give you my pros and cons. And take it from there. So let's go down. Buster. Okay, guys, here we are with the teapod kit. Um, well, we've actually got an empty box at the moment. What you get in there is the device itself, uh, and then the pod holds the uh, Nix Holt uh, in the carton. Um, get your little teapod kit, kit uh, instructions, caution, devices designed specifically for nicotine. 50 milligram salts, which obviously, obviously we don't uh, can't get, get in the UK. So there we go. In that you've got to open both bungs to, to fill the device. So I've gave this a bit of jip over the last week. Um, it stayed nice and clean, actually. It's been it's been quite good. I was. Uh, I suppose I was impressed with it actually. Um, when, when I took it down there, I, I, I sort of ate between ooh, fifteen hundred watts, let's say, and uh, like a good hit. And I was surprised, even though I was down the stables for say two hours and just occasionally just had a little toot on this, that um, you know I didn't have that. Oh, I need a, I need some nicotine. I need some nicotine. And uh, yeah, so it's it's been quite good in that. Um, very light. Uh, it's got a 500 milliamp battery. There's five clicks on and five clicks off. That is not actually um, a fire button. There's your charge port. This is just on off basically. Five clicks on, five clicks off. Uh, it's a draw to activate uh, teapod. Um, it's it is a tight draw. So you know it's it, it's excellent for people wanting to come off death sticks and to start uh, getting into vaping because it's tight draw, good uh, mouth to lung, um, nice cool vape, and I don't know if that's because I've got the own brew Nick Salt uh, Mister White in there, which is a, a, a nice um, sort of Eisenbergy. Um, flavor in actual fact so there's the pod on the top there we go as you can see the two fill ports where's my little pointer you've got fill port there and a fill port there all you do is flick them up and top it up with your juice um, it's as simple as that guys there we go inside actually just get the pod it just clicks into place it's as simple as that uh, old 2 mm juice it's got the 1.2 ohm ceramic coil now I found it says uh, 450 puffs to a full charge um, I got 470 um, so yeah they're, they're probably about right with 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 four, 450 and I didn't use all the salts as well um, I think I put in round right about just over a one one milliliter is it milliliter ml um yeah and that was 18 milligram nick salts uh own brew um okay on the screen itself and this is what i found quite useful was and i'm going to hold the button in because it times out quite quickly um as you can see it's a tesla sigs you can see the battery indicator how many push you've taken uh, how long was the last puff that you actually, or the last last draw, which was 3.8 seconds? You can see the ampage and you can see the voltage. Um, I think that's quite useful, uh, especially knowing, you know, the, the battery indicator for a start and how many puffs. And you know, if you get to about 400, it would be worth just sticking it on charge. And it actually only takes about one and a half hours from absolutely empty to fully charge this this pod um it's just nice in the end it's it's not heavy at all 
very portable um, you get actually if you draw on it for 10 seconds it then cuts out and says to you well it doesn't say to you you read long vaping cut off okay and uh, or, no sorry it says uh, long vaping and and then it cuts off um, so you can't you know I don't know whatever you if, if you're going to try and draw for more than 10 seconds good luck to you uh, five colour options I've got the blue one um, it doesn't come in red you know you get your normal colours blue green uh, silver black and I think it's um, gunmetal so yeah that's basically it guys um, I think if you want we could probably take it back oh in fact there is one thing right as you can see there I'm showing 63 puffs okay if I go one two three four five not fast enough one two three four five it says goodbye one two three four five it's coming back on puff counter zeroed okay so if you are wanting to know how many puffs you're getting from the battery etc etc just don't turn it off if you stick it in your pocket it's not going to activate because your pockets don't suck so uh, and if it just presses all that's going to happen is the screen's going to come on uh, it's, I think it's a, a 1.4 inch screen as well by the way um, I think uh, what um, let me just have a quick look here yeah it's it's 83 by 44 by 15 okay um yeah usb pod material is pc the device is saying that it is um metal but this is this is definitely same material as as the pod itself um yeah so okay guys what we'll do we'll take it up and uh, have a toot on it and i'll give you some pros and any cons that i've maybe come across all right cheers guys right guys we're back up top with the tesla sigs uh, teapod um zinc alloy pvc it's nice and light don't even know you've got it in the, your pocket to be to be fair it's not heavier than a load of bloody shrapnel that you keep in your pocket um to 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 get a good toot on it i generally do this Okay, now that was quite satisfying, but you've got to draw on it quite a lot. Um, so therefore, if you wish, it is a very discreet bit of kit. You know, you can take a little bit of a toot on it and really create no vapour. But if, if it's for a person that's actually coming off death sticks, I don't think that's a, a, a big problem. Um, they're not into cloud chasing and building on FPs and steam craves and what have you. Um, so pros, it's nice and light. It's not expensive. Um, Tony Stewart on Vaping 101 has actually got this on sale at the moment for £18.99 instead of basically 40 quid. So more than 50% discount there, guys. Uh, you get... In the box you get the pod itself uh, the device itself and one pod okay uh, I think I've already mentioned ceramic coil 1.2 ohms um, you can get the pods for it it's natural fact uh, you get a box there of three uh, again from vaping 101 instead of 14 quid then add down to nine pound so for about 28 quid, you've got a, a, a quite a good setup, to be fair. Um, 
yeah, so quite a lot of pros. I don't know if the con, it's not a con for me, but turning it on and off, oh, sorry, uh, you know, five clicks off, then putting it back on and it's zero in, it's, I don't know, it's not an issue for me. I never turn it off. It's always in my pocket. Um, my pocket doesn't suck, so it's not going to vape. Um, and if you touch the button, all it's going to do is just come on and just show you that you've had 65 puffs and your last one was 2.9 seconds. So, yeah, would I buy one for somebody I want to get off the death sticks? Yes, I would. Um, the only other teapod or the other the only other pod kit I can compare it with, uh, which I've yet to do a review on, is the Orion, the DNA Go. So um, that's a totally different device, to, for, to be fair. Um, but yeah, for mouth to lung, good bit of kit, thumbs up. Yeah, I would buy one. Cheers, guys. Thanks for watching.